Welcome to Breakthrough Barriers with Damali. I'm your host, Damali Peterman. On this podcast, we invite you to share a conflict that you need help navigating, and I, along with a guest co-host, will share what we would do in that situation to help you reach your breakthrough. Welcome to the show. artists of all this incredible work that you see here and we're live from Art Basel in Miami. Ola, thank you for allowing me to have this interview right here at Context Miami. How thank are, you for inviting me. Absolutely. How are you today? I feel great. I just had a sale oh, so I'm very happy. Congratulations. <laughs> thank what you. piece did you sell? I sold Captured mm -hmm. which was a large piece right in the center so and it's actually one of the last pieces I made and I made it especially for Art Basel, so That's amazing. It, it was meant to be. It must feel really great. It feels great. Wow, and Capture, can you tell us a little bit more about this piece? So it was the first piece that I made. It's a little similar to the ones, the pieces that are behind us here, okay. except that it's on thin metal. Okay. And it's, uh, I painted and collaged it, and then I cut it into strips, and I weave it through the metal fence. Oh wow! So it get, and it's a large contemporary portrait of a female. So it gives this impression of this strong. Somebody even called her sexy. I don't know. <laughs> uh, strong female, and despite the fact that sometimes we feel that we're cap captive, whether it's a physical ca captivity or psychological but it shows the strength that you can break through that captivity. Wow. I love break that breakthrough. Wow. <laughs> I, I love didn't it. even intend to say That's that. That's amazing. <laughs> well, we'll definitely put an image up. Is it something, was it a, the only I'll pull, version? I'll pull her out. She's right here She's in back. She's right there? Yeah, oh, we great. pulled it down and put up a new one. Oh, wow. So we can pull it out so you can see the image, That'll of course. That would be amazing. And I love the name Captured, and I love how you talk about how you could still pull strength, strength from it. Yes, so absolutely. I love it. Your work is so amazing and so beautiful, inspiring. I'm so, I, I feel empowered just sitting here in the midst of all this amazing Aww. art. Thank you very much. You're a, welcome. A, a large source of my inspiration is from a grandmother that I had never met. Really? Yes, because in Ukraine after World War II, my mother was 11 years old and she was separated from her mother and oh they gosh. never saw each other again because mm -hmm. my mother had to go west they were displaced people in austria for four years and then she ended up in america with my grandfather and then my grandmother unfortunately was sent to a labor camp in mordovia mm -hmm. and while she was there she secretly made beautiful embroideries mm -hmm. which she smuggled out wow. and so i imagine the strength that she must have had and i feel that her soul has basically entered mine because for the, the strength that she had to lose everything and still create these beautiful embroideries in hopes that it would reach her family one day, and it did. So That's incredible. Um, yeah. What a so beautiful I, story. I think that even you know when we're captured for whatever reasons or temporarily, it's important to find our wings mm -hmm. and know that to have the strength to, to carry on. And I see that in a lot of women. That's why I'm kind of obsessed with putting women in my artwork. I love it. And and why are you obsessed with women in your artwork? Putting them in it means what to you? I, I see the strength in women, this incredible strength, determination, tolerance, mm -hmm. patience, and hope, always hopeful. Yes. Yes. And I would also add, because what I love about art is that it's, it's so subjective, right? Right. And when I see your work, I think about grit, tenacity, perseverance. Yeah. I mean, there's so much strength, hope same words that you use but I also yeah. see like this this quiet persistence that yeah. just inspires everyone uh, yes quiet persistence is a beautiful way to put it thank you maybe I can uh, you know. <laughs> well it's funny um, I was I was going to ask you about what barriers that any did you break through any barriers to get here today and I love that you pulled back to your grandmother that you never met and how her journey really yeah. much set laid the groundwork for you to be here today definitely Definitely. And I think uh, part of that journey also included the fact that I started putting my own story into my artwork. Mm -hmm. And, um, you know, it, there, were, there would be a time where I'm thinking, oh, it's just my story, so how is that going to be interesting to anybody else because it's so personal? But mm -hmm. this personal story 
goes much larger into a lot of human themes of identity and freedom and mm -hmm. perseverance. And so I, that was one of the things I had to overcome. And, and, it, and it's true, it works, because as humans, we're all connected and we're all dealing with similar struggles. It's so true. So. And how long have you been coming to Art Basel? This is my second year participating. Wow, it seems Three like- Three years ago I visited for the first time. Wow. And then the next year I was in it, yeah. That's amazing. So there, there's hope for people who have, you know, a, amazing talent Absolutely. and background that they can come visit one year and- Absolutely. Work really hard to- Just <laughs> keep listening to that inner voice mm -hmm. and keep doing what you need to do. Uh, amazing. Well, I just want to thank you so much for this time. I know there are a lot of people in the gallery that are here to see you, so I don't want to take you oh, away from thank them. Thank you so we'll much. We'll get a picture of that of captured so everyone okay, can see we'll it. Do. And then we'll all look for your art everywhere. You're based in? I'm between Ukraine, Kiev, Ukraine, and New York City. Oh, that's amazing. So we'll put the links in the bottom so everyone knows where to find your art. Absolutely. Thank, thank you, you so, so much, much. Ola. Take care. Do you have any barriers that we can help you break through? If so, you can leave a brief message at 646-363-6322 or on our interactive blog at www.breakthroughadr.com. Please follow us on Twitter, Facebook, Instagram, and LinkedIn at the at sign B-R-E-A-K-T-H-R-O-U-G-H capital A capital D capital R. I'm your host, Damali Peterman, and this is Breakthrough Barriers with Damali. Although I am a lawyer, mediator, and an educator, and many of my co-hosts will represent various professions, we want to be clear that we are not providing legal advice, counseling, or suggestions. Our goal is to provide a roadmap for conflict resolution to generate future conflict resolvers. Continue to break through and have a wonderful day.